get all intimate here. Oh, look at this. <laughs> I'm not gonna put on some big old production here for you. I'm just here to tell you how my 2020 is gone. I Okay. Yes, yes. Oh, but now I look like freaking Kingpin. Let's. Ah, there we go. Is that loud enough? 2020. Where do I look? Where am I looking here? It has been a year. But for me, it hasn't been the same year that it has for everybody else, I feel like. I mean, there are some real horror stories of people not being able to pay rent, car payments, whatever payments they have to make. Monthly, they're just not able to. And unemployment is backed up, and, and systems are like... Just not up to date. My 2020 was not a horror story. I mean, it's the year that I got famous. And I don't even want to use that word. I want to say this humbly because, I mean, it's it's popularity for me. It's not like a you're famous type thing. But people, I mean, people say it all the time. When I'm recognized in public, it, you know, I mean, it does happen. That'll be the word that they use is famous. You're, t this guy's TikTok famous. Uh, so I guess I am allowed to use the word. Unemployment took great care of me when I didn't have a job and then I did have jobs and I was able to work and make money in 2020. And now I have a job with the state, which then sends me into 2021 with three sources of income. Two of them are social media platforms and then the third is, is an actual day, a full time job. So that in a few sentences is how my year has gone. I mean, it's a great year for me. In the past 28 days, I've had 84 million TikTok views at all. I mean, that's the last month. What's today? So, in the past, it took me one year to get to a million on TikTok. Two months to get to two million, and now, in like a week, I think I've, I'm have i at 2.4. Which is still just crazy to imagine. Or even wrap my head around. But my work is constantly being seen right now, which is new for me. That's That's a new... Period. And one thing that I promise not to do on here is to be a YouTuber. Smash that like button. I'm not ever going to say that. If you want to find my work, you can come find my work. I'm not going to treat you like a, a subscribe. No. No. You're not getting that from me. That's not going to happen. I think what I respond to in the comments is uniqueness. If your comment stands out from the rest, then I'll like acknowledge it and even respond and... Oh, that jazz. So, that's all I'm saying is like, the weirder you are, uh, the more I'm gonna like it because I'm a weird uh, mother ever. Is that allowed? I'll just leave it at that. To all of you that have had like, uh, not so good 2020, I don't mean this in any negative way towards you. In fact, I love to be the thing that provided some release or some relief in your life that allowed you to look forward to my videos, to check them out, to watch them over and over and have you kind of escape. I've, I've always thought of my place, my work, my channel to be a place of zen, where people can come, spend the most time that they want, escape any outworld, what? <laughs> escape any outward worries, trifes, ultimately just have a good time. So, again, thank you, and uh, we will be seeing each other soon.